So on the inside of this bag is a solution for you indecisive peeps should you have trouble deciding between french fries and onion rings when it comes to getting your favorite burger or chicken sandwich over here. Enter the Havsies, and of course they're up next for you here on the channel. Stay tuned because I'm Ian Kay and you're about to peep this out. Welcome to Peep This Out Reviews with Ian Kay. Stay frosty. Yeah, buddy, it's another one for the BK playlist here on the channel, guys. Individually, fries and onion rings together in one. Very simply called the Havsies over here. And I gotta say, looking really nice. A nice little box of crispy action on this one. And real quickly, let me break it on down for you fully before we get right into it. All right, so you already know what's coming with this one, guys. What I've got here is a large order of a combination of their French fries and onion rings together in one, hence the name Havsies. So if you can't decide between French fries and onion rings, now you've got them together. And I gotta say, guys, looking pretty nice for this size order. Very crispy, especially on those onion rings. And I gotta say, presentation-wise, they always present pretty nicely. For dipping, how could I not pair this up with their zesty sauce, aka the onion ring sauce? This is the perfect pairing to go with this, and naturally we're going to do just that. But guys, again, for what this is, I got to say, very simple, but at the same time, it's a combination of what they do very well over here for their side items. And in this case, they're put together, the fries and the onion rings over here at BK, also known as the Havsies. Of course, we're going to peep out this flavor right now. Yeah, since I've never reviewed the fries or the onion rings separately ever because they typically come with the meals if I ever decide to review a combo, I figured today would be a nice time to really kind of give this one a shot. And I kind of feel like going in on these because the onion rings are always a banging situation. Of course, we're going to get into some of that zesty sauce. Let's just go for a few of the fries real quick and then we'll go for a little dip dip. But as you can see, nicely salted on this particular one. Let's give it a shot. The French fries, the half 50% portion of the Havsies over here. Let's peep this out. Nice and fresh. Lots of potato on the inside. Very, very nice, guys. Light crispiness on the outside as well. The saltiness is on point. Mm. You can fade the fries over here. They're pretty good. I know a lot of you guys are like McDonald's fries are better, but I like BK's fries, especially when they're fresh out of the fryer right now. A very nice combination as it tries to stay focused. Not bad. Very tasty. A quickie little review for you guys. As of this filming, we're about a week and a half out from Christmas. So by the time you see this, it's either going to be on Christmas Eve or Christmas Day. I hope this review finds you well and gearing up for the holidays naturally. Not bad. One more fry. We'll get into some onion ring action really quick here. Very, very tasty, guys. And again, the saltiness is on point right now. It's a nice little snack. $3.29 for the large or $2.99 for the medium. I figured for the extra 30 cents, why not just get the large, right? Not a bad deal. And... When they consist of these right here. I love the onion rings over here. Very nice. Mmm. That unmistakable BK flavor. Crispy outer coating. A little ring of onion that's in there, as you can see. Very nice. Mmm. I'm digging these right now. Basically having a little bit of a snack with you guys on camera. I'm digging it. And again, portion size. Not bad. This is pretty tall for what this is. Very, very nice. I wish they kind of had them like in those little longer trays sometimes that they usually have like with the tots back in the day to kind of fill it more. But it's a fairly decent distribution of 50% of each of them that are in here. More of the rings are on the bottom and then naturally some of them are on top. A little bit of bag fry action as well too because there's a lot here. So not bad. Mm, they are very tasty. All right. Another close up. Tasty, tasty, tasty. And of course, guys, outside of the ranch over here, which I totally dig, the zesty sauce is so banging. You can have this pretty much on anything here, and it works very nicely. A little combination of horseradish action mixed in with this one here. It looks almost like thousand, but it is not. So let's go for a little bit of onion ring sauce, technically on some of the fries first real fast. Mmm, that is so good. The saltiness of those fries. A little bit of a bite that I'm getting from the zesty. Let's go for it. When I dip you dip, we dip some freak nasty action for you. This is the ultimate pairing of the zesty sauce over here. Outside of putting it on some of their other food naturally, like I mentioned. Let's go for it with the ring. Mmm. Always. Crispy outer coating. Light horseradish. It's thick. It's rich. And it works amazingly well. Mm. It's a fun little promo for what this is, naturally. Havsies. They really should keep this on the menu 
always personally sometimes you get some deals on the app where you can get like one of each it's like a buck fifty a piece something like that so you're saving a little bit plus you get more of each because they're a large but this is pretty decent for what it is if you can't decide on what you want to get you've got an option with the halvesies over here pretty nice let's go for another couple real quick mm. love it fun little snack to go in on with you guys as we're rounding out 2023 crazy that the year is almost over already I'm so glad that it finally is. All right, let's go for one more bite quickly on this one. We'll wrap up this little quickie review with the rating coming up next, but I'm glad I gave the halvesies a shot. And like I said, probably my only time I would ever do the individual rings or the fries here on my channel outside of the usual combos that they come with or if that gets included on a burger, one of the king sandwiches naturally. Banging situation. Let's go for one more and we'll wrap this one up. Hang on. Mm. Well, it's familiar BK side item flavor with any of the available dipping sauces you want to go with here, guys. But again, pair it up with that zesty. Y'all thank me for it. The combination of that along with the fries is pretty decent as well. But it really comes to life when you make sure it goes up with those rings. It's very, very nice with this one, guys. And a fun little promo as well, too. All right, so with that said, I'm gonna have to give the halvesies over here at Burger King just an okay seven out of 10. I mean, it's okay for what it is. Like I said, for you indecisive peeps out there, you've got an option to go in on without feeling like you have to get either or. It's nice to have them together, but do take a look at the app itself in terms of the offers. Sometimes you may see two separately for a similar price point to getting this together. So like I said, it is what it is. It's fun pairing it up with your sauce of choice. In this case, Zesty was the way to go. At least I'm recommending that you do that. The flavor is pretty banging with that quote unquote onion ring sauce, but again, it's fun for what it is, even if it is still that familiar BK flavor. But the onion rings, like I said, they rock over here. They really do. All right, so do me a quick favor like always. Drop those comments down below. First and foremost, what do you like better over here at BK, the fries or the onion rings? And based upon that selection, what's your favorite sauce of choice if it's outside of Zesty? Drop those comments down below and definitely let me know. Oh, and hey, should you actually be watching this on either Christmas Eve or Christmas Day? Shoutouts to each and every one of you and a very Merry Christmas to all of you guys who are celebrating. Naturally, a very, very happy holiday season to you and your family. And hey, let's get ready for 2024 because we all have the opportunity to make it the best year yet. And with that, this is Ian K closing out another high quality foodie feature for you here on Peep This Out Reviews, bringing you brand new content every single week here on my channel. So why stay tuned for the next review coming real soon. In the meantime, stay frosty. Hey guys, I'd like to take a quick moment to thank all of our YouTube channel members and Patreon supporters. Guys, thank you so very much for your monthly contribution to the channel. It's because of your direct support that the channel continues to grow, and you really do help me to keep delivering the content that you want to see. I couldn't do it without you, and I seriously appreciate the love and support. Thanks again for all you do, and for being such a big part of our positive community here on the platform. Hey, thanks for checking out this review, guys. But just in case you didn't see the one I did before this one, you can find it right up over here, along with what I think YouTube's gonna recommend for you to check out as well. As always, I think you'll find something to like in both of them, and I'll definitely catch you in the next one. See ya.